Hi, this is Jolanda Van Veen, and in this segment, we're going to learn all about the Liriopa spicata. It's a beautiful plant that's evergreen that's from Asia. So the Liriopa is native to China, Japan, Taiwan, and Vietnam. So it's amazing, it can handle cold temperatures down to zone 4 and then warm climates to zone 10. So it's a really versatile plant. So they call the Liriopa creeping lily turf, but it really isn't creeping at all. It grows more like a mondo grass or grass. So the Liriopa is not a creeping lily turf. It's more similar to mondo grass and it'll grow and even the leaves will darken up. And so they're a great foliage for wintertime too. And I always say they're from Japan, so they're probably related to the mondo grass. And they grow very similarly and they do multiply. So they will kind of creep, but they'll just make bigger clumps, even like bamboo does. So you can start the Liriopa or the creeping lily turf by seed in the spring, or you can take any of the divisions, you can just separate them just like you would grass or mondo grass. And as long as you've got a stem and root, you can make a new plant. And you can pretty much do that any time of the year. They're very, very versatile and very hardy. Some people call the Liriopa by another name, and you can buy it sometimes by the name of Ophia Pogon. And so sometimes there's a little bit of confusion as to which it is, but either way, they're an evergreen, and they'll come back every year, and they're just so rewarding in the garden. And they give you a flower, too. Just like mondo grass, in late summer, you'll get a little pale purple flower on your liriopa, and they're just really cute, almost like a little lily of the valley. So they are a creeping lily turf, but they grow more like a bamboo or a mondo grass. They're a gorgeous addition to your garden.